If you always have issues fixing a zipper to a stretchy materials or stretchy dresses, this is a perfect video for you. And if you're interested in learning how to fix the zipper to your dress, just like what you're seeing on the screen, you are welcome. Let's get started. To get started, I have a stretchy fabric here. This fabric is very stretchy. I'll go ahead, I've cut out the back part. So I'll go ahead and fix, you know, a zipper to it. Just follow me as I fix a zipper to this stretchy fabric. So after I was done fixing a zipper, as you can see, it has that wavy effect. No matter how gently you fix a zipper to a stretchy fabric, you will always have that, you know, wavy effect. So the first tip is um, when you get a very stretchy fabric, look for the part that is not very stretchy. So this part is very stretchy, but this part is not very stretchy. The part that is not very stretchy is the part where your center back is going to be. This part is not as stretchy as the other side. So that part that is not as stretchy as the other side is where your center back is going to be. I've gone ahead to cut out my, you know, my um send uh, my back part now so the second tip is after you are done cutting out the back part you are going to grab an interfacing very important the interfacing should be able to cover your zipper space so you want to go ahead and iron that interfacing to it as you can see i've ironed my interfacing to it and from the look of uh, things the that particular side looks very stable so when you have attached your interfacing you want to go ahead now and fix your zipper so let's go ahead and fix the zipper to the center back this is me on the sewing machine so i will go ahead and fix a zipper to this uh, center back and let's see the final result So when I was done, this is what I have. Did you see that? So when I was done, this is what I have. So beautiful. Did you see? There is no wavy effect. Everything laid down flat. So that is how to fix a zipper to your stretchy fabric. So if you have learned something, don't forget to give this video a like. Kindly share. See you in my next tutorial. Bye.